Hello and welcome to the Slingshot channel to a short introduction on my latest project the gear knife. <laughs> Let me show you its features. The idea behind this is that I would really love to design a knife that has a little electric motor that can very quickly open and close the blade like this. So what I need is something that turns like a rotational uh, motion as generated by a motor into something that opens and closes a knife, like so. Right? So my first attempt were fairly lousy because I put the wheel right in the middle of this thing here and uh, that resulted in a very short blade. It looked like super embarrassing. <laughs> like going for a swim on a really cold day if you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> in any case, this iteration is a lot better because what I did is I put the, uh, the uh, wheel here on an angle so that I can extend it and go back to it at any time. And this of course forced me to put the rack inside of the blade like this. Where of course this has several disadvantages like it easily can accumulate dirt. So, so this is probably not the final result but what it does do is it provides perfect functionality like so. Now this version of course it works both ways so I can also go like this and I can even shake it open like so. <laughs> but that is of course only because it's a wooden gear set right now. It was a lot of work to put these gears in. You know, I mean this is very fine saw work that I had to do. Now there are really really tiny electric motors and also really really small batteries such as like used in drones and so on. So it would not be very hard to integrate this into this here. And of course in the end version, um, you know, the simulation is very easy. So this would of course not be done by this battery drill but by a very small motor. And it could easily extend and go back with the blade back and forth. Now of course a lot of people will now say use a warm uh, drive, like a warm screw. But that has the disadvantage that it's very slow. The thing is that a warm screw, you know, for a blade like this, you know, would need about 70 turns to eject and retract this. 70 turns. So you would have to put a very fast, very loud motor in. While this one here is only taking about, I would say maybe two and a half turns, you know, to fully extend the blade. So this is way quicker than the other solution, which means that I can use a motor that turns a lot slower and still be good enough. So, uh, so I think that this is the better option and also makes the whole system very flat. I mean, this is of course fairly big knife still, but it also has a fairly long blade, you know, so, so this of course definitely can be more compact if you, you go for a slimmer blade and for a shorter blade maybe, but the functionality in itself is already there. So what do you think about this new concept? <laughs> I'm really trying to invent something that is new and that hasn't been introduced before. So, uh, and ultimately of course it will be made, for, made from steel and everything. So that's it for today. I hope you liked this. Thanks and <laughs> bye bye. <laughs>